Okay, here's a quick walkthrough of my uh, Sabretooth 2x25 configuration. Um, first thing I wanted to point out was the receiver is being powered by this battery pack. And the reason is uh, this high-tech 8-channel receiver, which is model number HFD08RO, um, the Sabertooth battery elimination circuitry cannot power this reliably and the receiver would cut out and the Sabertooth would go into failsafe, the robot would jerk to a stop, um, then the Sabertooth would sense the receiver again right away, um, quickly do a reset, and then it automatically calibrates the uh, position of the sticks on the radio every time it's booted up well that would happen immediately with the sticks in the wrong position and um, would follow everything up so the only way I could prevent all that from happening was to power the receiver with its own six volts and you cannot run that six volts back in to the saber tooth this terminal here is empty uh, you'll notice there's no red wire running between the receiver and the saber tooth. All you've got is ground, signal, and signal. And uh, they're, they're on the same ground, but the voltages are being supplied differently. The voltage being supplied to the saber tooth is 24 volts. Um, I'm running uh, 350 to 400 watts, something like that, wheelchair motors with uh, two 12 volt lead acid batteries, which is what they were originally powered with. And um, anyway, the tip switch configuration on the Sabertooth is, uh, here's pin one, this side is on, so pin one is off, pin two is on, pin three is on, pin four is on, pin five is off, pin six is on, or I should say switch. So switch is one through six, off, on, 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 off, on.